Well, <laughs> I haven't got much choice. I'm going to end up, I'm going to put my toolbox, let's put my toolbox in the corner there. I said put the toolbox in the corner. Now I'm going to enter the closet. And now we play the waiting. For a silent assassin, he breathes really loudly. And now we simply play the waiting game. Because I need that man there to be in this place here. And that's going to take a long, long, long time. So, you'll spot a cut-out segment or a fast-forwarded segment. I don't know. I'm, I, I can't imagine a, a bloke sat in a cupboard is going to be uh, entertaining in speedy motion or any other motion. So, momentarily, you'll be back with me viewing a man in a cupboard as opposed to... Uh, I'll be... Just join me in a second and... Okay, so we're back, but we have to be very quiet because there's a man in the room. I have been stood in his wardrobe for the past six to seven minutes and... Ah, no! Shh! Whoever made a loud noise, shut up! Very quiet. Ah! He sees us! No, oh, he's an idiot. That's acceptable. You see that gun there he's holding? The idea is we actually exchange the real World War pistol that we have in our possession with his fake one. And he is then going to do something with it. I won't reveal what, but I think you can guess. Come on, my man. You must leave. Good. Good lad. Right. He's left. Now we spring into action. We spring into action. Put down the real WW1 pistol. Prick up the prop WW1 pistol. Take the prop WW1 pistol and enter the closet again. <laughs> I'm going to hang out in the closet until he comes back. Let's just flip the map open. I believe that's him. That's him there. I could probably leave in fairness. Go on, I'm going to potentially fuck it up, but I'm going to be cheeky. I'm going to grab my toolbox. Oh, that was a little bit tight. I didn't do anything in your dressing room, if that's what you were thinking. Whoa, I haven't done anything to you either, Sunshine. Whoa, whoa, don't fall. Oh, he's, he's actually... Right, he's just a bodyguard. That's fine. That's acceptable. Now, that appears to be an exit, so I'm going to use that. That's going downstairs, though. I don't... Oh, no. Although I might need to go up... I might need to go downstairs, go upstairs. Now, I've got very little time. Hurry up. Hurry up, Hitman. I want to retrieve my suit, which is why I'm in a bit of a hurry. If I didn't want to retrieve the suit, I wouldn't be in quite such a hurry. But I do rather desire grasping my suit again. Ah, oh, knackers. Where do I go? Where do I go? Where do I go? Uh, there's stairs there. Hello. Hello, sir. I'm not doing anything suspicious. Please lead me somewhere decent. Oh, more decent than you could possibly imagine. Marvellous. Right, let's get to the bathroom quickly. Quickly. Quickly, I need a pee. I need a pee, damn it. Hello. Hello. Yes. Now, please fuck off. Drop the toolbox. No suit retrieval for me. Shut the door. Shut the door. No suit retrieval costs for me, sir. Because I am that good. Um, We should be all right keeping that on me. I'm slightly paranoid from previous events where I actually kept something I ought not have kept. Right, now we play some more of the waiting game because now we simply, it's easier to, do you know, it might be easier. Maybe not. No, okay. Uh, I don't know. Um, indecision, indecision, indecision. It's easier if I can remain by this door because then I get a swift exit. But I don't really want to be in the way too much. Because this is my go. This 
This still has the potential to go horribly wrong, even though I've practiced and practiced and practiced some more. Come on, hurry up with the scene, my friends. Sewer. It's a sewer. it's a sewer? No, it's a theatre. Chum. Who said it was a sewer, you dickhead? Do you not know where you are? God. Some people are idiots. He thinks he's in a sewer. How insane is he? Anyway, right, those two are marching forwards. Go on. Go on. Shoot him. Will you shoot him now? I demand you shoot him now. Don't test my patience, game. I have none to be tested. I will fail your test. Hello. Don't look at me. Don't look at me, Mr. Bodyguard. Mr. Bodyguard. Body. <laughs> if I keep shouting baldy at him, he's going to get slightly pissed off, aren't I? Ah! There's another baldy! It's the bald guard convention! They're twins! I just met your twin brother down there. I think I met your triplet brother downstairs as well, didn't I? That's quite incredible. You know, to have triplets not only in the same theatre is probably rare, but triplets all with the exact same job? That's got to be a, quite a rare occasion, methinks. This is a great game for action, isn't it? I'm stood by a door, and you're watching. <laughs> I don't know. He was born twitchy, was he? I don't know. Yeah, maybe. One of those triplets may have been born twitchy. But I don't know who's the sadder, really. Me watching. Me talking whilst stood doing nothing next to a door, or you watching me watching and listening me talking whilst I'm stood by a door doing nothing. Right, get ready, get ready. Because of course, as we all know, he didn't use a fake gun. He used a real gun. That's target one. Slaughtered. Slaughtered to death. But uh, nobody seems to realise he is a good actor. I think that's the problem. He is such a good actor. They all think this is a performance. He's been down there quite a long time. I think... Aren't we supposed to start the scene again? No, we're not. Because he's dead. He's distinctly dead. He's deadly distinct. Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't look at me. Right. Trip. Boom! Oh, there's the thing. There's the thing. Right, now. Calm. They don't know I had a detonator. They don't know I had a bomb. So we just walk. Walk calmly to the door. Walking calmly past the security guard with the glasses. I'm just off. I I've had enough of the opera. Cheerio, Tosca. Yes. Oh, he's dead. And I'm escaping! <laughs> A perfect pair of gillings. Or at least I think they're perfect. We'll have to wait and see. What the fuck are you up to? Why have you got a gun? Total kills! Zero! Shots fired! Zero! Shots hit! Zero. But... If I didn't shoot any shots, if I didn't shoot any shots, no shots could have hit. Close combat, zero. Accidents, two. Caught on camera, no. No witnesses. Oh, I am a god. I am a silent assassin. No, I have never been a silent assassin. Oh, this is fantastic. Take that, LP curse! Fuck you! I'm a silent assassin. I did better being recorded than any other occasion. No need for suit retrieval, sir. I retrieved it myself. And in fairness, I didn't take any weapons with me because I don't need weapons. I use the environment. That is how good an assassin I am. Let's have a quick butcher's at the paper. Alvaro Delavard killed. Police suspect blood money is involved. The Paris police.
confirm this morning that world famous tenor Alvaro del Vard, de Alvard, I don't know, and U.S. Embassy Secretary Richard Delahunt were found dead at the famous Garnier Opera House yesterday. The police have stated that the lack of witnesses is making this an especially difficult case to investigate. The police have absolutely no clue of the killer's appearance as nobody claims to have seen him or her because I did it perfectly. Let's have a look. Um, explosive temper he had. Yeah, explosive temper which led to an explosive chandelier. You were killed by the chandelier. I have the chandelier in the library and it was Professor Plum. No, well it could have been Professor Plum because nobody knew anything else. The Bulgarian court attempted to prosecute him for statutory rape of a 13 year old girl. The case was dropped and the hitman steps in. Cats spark killer explosion. <laughs> oh, little cute, little cute little cat. Cute little cat. US Veep Burke dead. Oh, Vice. Veep. Oh, I suppose. Yeah, right. VP Vice wasn't. Fair enough. Veep Burke sounds distinctly insulting. Hey, you. You is a Veep Burke. Burke, in fairness, is... Never mind. Plus, maxima, ten, minima, un, trois. Hippopotamus, blue, is invisible. That, that's a weird-looking picture. Very weird-looking picture. Personne peut le voir partir fortement comme un ninja japonais. Vous êtes tout ouverture de annonce. <laughs> I'm sure that's not pronounced like that. They're one hundred percent. Oh, we must do. Set the fool. Election day, USA. Sell on how to replace an American vice president. You just get another man or woman in the chair, surely. Brazilian ambassador to Kenya shot dead in Brussels. Oh, he was shot in the Brussels. I bet that was nasty. La tour Eiffel construite par the Alliance de Jupiter. Frogs and invasion of babies! It's an invasion of babies! With enormous feet! Is that, do you reckon that's what a baby space marine looks like with those enormous feet? Uh, anyway, let's move my microphone slightly. Press enter, get to the familiar Cheerio screen, and do you know what's going to happen? I'm going to say Cheerio in a moment or two. I'm going to, you know, a little tantalising tease of when am I going to say it? Am I going to say it now? No. <laughs> I'm going to say it now. Cheerio. <laughs> 